Madison Hope was recently named the Manitoba High School Athletics Association Urban Athlete of the Week. A well-deserved honor, but it only begins to shed some light on just how good she really is. The grade 12 student at Dakota Collegiate has quickly become one of the most dominant female players in high school fastball. Hope credits a longtime friend and her dad for getting her started in the sport when she was in elementary school. When we were in uh, elementary school, she asked me to play and I had never really wanted to play softball until she asked me and I decided, okay, I guess I'll play. And then uh, my dad always played hardball. So right when I got into playing, he always encouraged me and we went out practicing all the time. And that's how I got really into it. Turns out it was a pretty good choice, especially when it came to gravitating towards the mound. There was just no pitchers on the team and they asked me if I wanted to start pitching and I was pretty young so I said sure and then me and my dad we just always went out to the field to practice and that's how I started. Practice has led to near perfection. With the help of softball Hall of Famer Greg Bouchard, Hope has been putting up impressive numbers. For instance, at the recent Dakota Lancer tournament, she threw two no-hitters and struck out most of the batters she faced. She also had a batting average that was close to 700, a number almost unheard of when it comes to fastball. And just for good measure, she maintains an 85% academic average. According to her coach, it all comes down to work ethic. I know she maintains good grades. She also works part-time. Um, plays on our high school team as well as the Angels. Um, on top of that, she spends countless hours with pitching lessons, pitching on her own time, um, begging me to come in for more pitching lessons, things like that. But she, um, she just works hard and she wants to be great at the sport and she's wanted to be great at the sport since she was young. And to no one's surprise, the hard work is paying off in a big way. Hope's achievements have caught the collective eye of the North American fastball world. She's been identified as a potential starter for the national team. Her success has also led to an opportunity south of the border. Next year, I've committed to go to Loyola, University of Chicago. So that's a D1 NCAA school. Um, I leave, I'm gonna go August 20th. I start school on the 25th. Um, they just finished their season this year. They got second in the Missouri Valley Conference, which is pretty good. I'm hoping next year we can win it. <laughs> I'm excited about that. Madison's actually going NCAA Division I, which is a huge jump. But in speaking with her over her choices and choosing a school, things along those lines, um, I think she has made the right choice with where she's going. But I think the part that's going to make her most successful is how passionate she is about being great and being prepared for the next jump. For Go Winnipeg, I'm Al Foster.